We start with the political scandal that refuses to go away. Prosecutors investigating the missing 2007 Inter-Korean summit transcript will summon dozens of former President No Mu Hun's key aides from Monday. Earlier this week, the prosecution concluded that the transcript does not exist at the National Archives. Our political correspondent Kim Young-ji reports. Former Presidential Secretary for Security Affairs Cho Myung-gyun attended the 2007 Inter-Korean Summit and recorded the conversation between South Korean President Noh Moo-hyun and then North Korean leader Kim Jong-il. Cho reportedly told prosecutors in February that President Noh asked him to delete the summit minutes from the EG-1 electronic archive system used at the presidential office at the time. He added that No had wanted to transfer the transcript to the National Intelligence Service so the next administration could easily access it. But he didn't want it going to the National Archives, where records remain confidential for up to 30 years. Earlier this week, prosecutors said they discovered traces of the original transcript that had been registered but deleted from a duplicate of the EG-1 system President No took with him. However, prosecutors also found an edited version of the transcript saved in the EG-1 duplicate, which they say is virtually identical to the copy the National Intelligence Service has. From next Monday, prosecutors will summon and question President No's former aides on why the transcript had not been transferred to the Central Archives, but an edited transcript was transferred to the spy agency. Lawmaker Moon Jae-in of the main opposition Democratic Party, who served as President Noh's chief of staff, could also be summoned. In June, the spy agency disclosed its version of the summit transcript, stoking political row over whether President Noh had made remarks about nullifying the Northern Limit Line, a western sea border with North Korea, during his talks with Kim Jong-il. Moon at the time demanded they look at the transcript kept at the National Archives and vowed to stake his political life on President No never having made such comments. Kim Hyun-ji, Arirang News.